Hello to anyone that's clicking on the video. If you've been here before and watched the previous videos, welcome back. If you're new, clicking on. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Hope all is well with everyone. It is snowing at Hogwarts. It's super cool. Now that the season has changed to winter, it's just really cool to see everything. So at the end of the last video, we completed Charles Rookwood's trial. And there's going to be another trial. There's four keepers, so I would assume there's going to be four trials. So we're waiting on the next one. We have a quest to go meet up with our friend Poppy, who we met in Beast class. Before I do that, I'm going to meet Sebastian. He's asked to meet me outside the Slytherin common room. And he's got some information. And it says the reward is the spell Crucio. So I'm that's a curse spell. So I'm interested in learning that. Again, appreciate you click, clicking on the video and watching. If the video warrants it, please click the like button. And let's get back into it. I cannot win, but don't be sure. I can't wait to watch you try. Can't catch peeps. Never been to the Slytherin common room, just my own for Gryffindor. I'm sure someone's gonna throw a fit, I'm over here. Revelio. You're here. Brilliant. I received your owl. What happened with Ominous? I told him none of us will be able to avoid dark magic forever. So the more we know about Salazar Slytherin and the dark arts, the better prepared we'll be. Unfortunately, only a Gaunt knows the location of the Scriptorium's entrance, and Ominous won't tell me. Hmm. Perhaps I should have a chat with Ominous. You? I suppose it's worth a try. But don't get your hopes up. Ominous is annoyingly stubborn. Nothing new. I know where he is. I'll lead you to him and then leave you to it. Come on. He's this way. The last time I met Omnibus, he had a Keep massive an eye out. attitude. Never know who's watching. Although that hasn't stopped us before. Strictly speaking, it has. We were caught. Damned poltergeist. Such a nuisance. There he is. Good luck. What are you doing here? Hello, Ominous. Do you have a moment? What is it? What have you and Sebastian been up to now? Please, Ominous. I confided in you before about what happened with the Undercroft. Sebastian simply wanted me to have a safe place to practice some spells, to try and catch up to the other fifth years. He didn't think you'd mind. <sighs> I suppose that makes sense. It's just Sebastian's been pestering me lately about something and I'm frustrated with him. Don't tell me he's still going on about, what was it, a scriptorium? He told you about that? He did. We were talking about Hogwarts founders and he mentioned it. Wouldn't say much more, though. Yes, well, he seems to think it contains the answer to saving Anne. I think it's likely full of dark magic that is better left untouched. Wait, you've never been inside? Of course not. I only know about it because of my favourite aunt, Noctua. She thought like I do. Didn't agree with the family on the use of dark magic. In fact, 
She'd hoped to convince my family that there was more to Salazar Slytherin than worshipping pure blood status. She'd heard of this scriptorium and thought its contents might shed some light on him. She even found the secret entrance in this very corridor. She wrote regularly to my father about her efforts to gain access, and then she simply vanished. No one else ever tried to enter. I'm sorry about your aunt. Don't you want to find out what happened to her? Aunt Noctua went down this path with good intentions and lost her life. I don't want the same to happen again. You don't know that history will repeat itself. Besides, you said your aunt thought like you. This could honour her memory, get you answers about Slytherin and Sebastian answers for Anne. Your aunt pursued this alone. We could do it together. Hmm. I see what you've done here. And I confess, you've convinced me. I didn't think it possible. Very well. I shall tell you what I know. Fetch Sebastian, I'll wait. I hope I... We don't regret this. Sebastian! Over here! These braziers grant access to the scriptorium. Now you'll share? You wouldn't tell me when I practically begged. It wasn't you who told me what I needed to hear. Opening the entrance has something to do with threes. Well, three heads are better than one. It's two heads are better than one. And by that logic, three is better than two. Simple mathematics, Ominous. Open Slytherin's door. Where's the door? Well, it shows a staircase behind there, so we must need to get in there. What do we do with these? Revelio may help. Revelio! Remember, three braziers are involved. <laughs> Someone was actually listening. I do that. Occasionally. So three of them, we've got three that are highlighting, so we must need to move we got Whoops. That's not working. Oh, these, I think we can light these up. Let's try that instead. Incendio. That brazier went out on its own. I wonder if it's a clue. Probably gonna have to light them faster. Ready for this. Switch that back. Here we go. Looks like a locked door. We may want to look around. Let's
letter from his aunt. A journal entry, signed by Noctua Gaunt. Gaunt? Ominous. Your family was here. I know. She was my aunt. You knew? And didn't tell me? Ominous. The journal mentions many challenges ahead. That's why I said this could be dangerous. Aunt Noctua kept my father informed until she vanished. I think we're going to need some a few spells here, so... Lumos! I think this needs repaired. Repairer! There may be something to this pile of rubble. The rubble formed a relief of a person facing a snake. That must be the voice I hear. Lumos. The voice is ancient. You hear a voice. It started when you repaired that relief. I hear a whisper saying, speak to me. I'm a parcel mouth. I can hear and speak to snakes. Nearly all known parcel mouths are descended from Salazar Slytherin. I'd like to be able to talk to snakes. You might not want the ability to speak parcel tongue. It's often associated with dark wizards. I haven't spoken it in ages, but I'd wager if I speak it now, the door will open. I'm hoping you're having second thoughts. Believe me, I am having thoughts, but I'm still convinced we should go ahead. It's ironic. When I left home, I vowed to leave the Dark Arts behind, and yet here I am. Stand back. I can't believe I'm doing this. It worked! Ominous, you possess a rare ability indeed. Between the two of you, I'm starting to feel left out. Between the two of us? I... never mind. There's no clear way forward. Like a maze. Salazar Lumos. Slytherin most likely wanted this to be difficult to solve. The door we came from, it closed. And there's more than one gate ahead. Then look closely at each gate for clues. Dial requires focus. Art Noctua said the same. It may take practice to solve it. Matching the symbols did open it. I was about to do that myself, but you got to it first. <laughs> Lumos, nice work. This is like a maze in here. Revelio. Lumos. No idea how you open that. Another letter. This journal entry, it mentions getting lost and being unwelcome. Poor Aunt Noctua. Another, there's another lock, which I'm guessing is this here. And we have... Those two logos. We'll see if that works. Another gate. Seems Slytherin like to play games. Must run in the family. Look in a mirror, Sebastian. Okay. 
can't see the symbols. It's too dark. That didn't sound good. Salazar Slytherin didn't make this easy. Lumos. Oh, I think you need to light that. Yeah. There's too <laughs> You need too many spells in this thing. Alright, that helps. A little bit. Well, the dire, isn't it? You sound surprised. We're in a maze designed by Salazar Slytherin. You only have so much time. There's that one. That sounded promising. Another dial solved. Impressive. Nice work. We've got more to solve ahead. Search each corridor. It may not be obvious which leads where. Yeah, I gotta go back and get the other one. Alright. I opened this one first, so I'm gonna go look. See what's in here. Lumos. So maybe this opens the door on the other side. I need to find out. There's another letter. Ominous. Your aunt wanted to change your family's traditions. She did. And she was my favorite person in the world for it. Lumos. What's well, this doorway? That's the door we need to open. To remember some more letters. Noctua references painful and arduous challenges, but also rewards. Painful. That's the part I'm wary of. All I heard was rewards. Keep going. Okay, these are the two symbols. Although the bottom one's difficult to read. We'll try to see if we can we can figure it out. So head, head back up the steps. Another, not the welcoming sort, was he? <sighs> Excellent work. We're another step closer to the scriptorium. I think I barely got that one. That snake was getting ready to strike. Lumos. Spotted something ahead. Looks troubling. This whole place is troubling, but for my aunt's sake, we cannot stop now. Uh. 
The gate! I think we're locked in. Again. <sighs> then Salazar Slytherin is not yet finished with us. Ominous. Her skeleton. And Noctua's last journal entry. She mentions being trapped here, blocked by an unforgivable curse. This is where she died. This is where we'll die. I shouldn't have listened to either of you. Ominous, I'm truly sorry about your aunt. But I know what to do. It's going to be difficult. You said you know what to do. Tortured faces on the door, and Crucio is etched into the stone. My guess is if we cast the Cruciatus curse, the door will open. That's why Noctua died. She had no one to cast the curse on. Ominous has the most experience with this. He should cast it. You seem to be in Ominous's favor. Will you ask him about this? He does seem a bit cross with you. I'll speak with him. Good. Work your magic, so to speak. Wish we had some liquid luck. All of this could have been avoided. Ominous. I hadn't imagined we'd end up trapped like this. Salazar Slytherin did. He's to blame for many unimaginable things. I overheard you and Sebastian, and I won't do it. The Cruciatus Curse is pure torture, I would know. Sebastian told me a little of what happened when you were young. Sounds as if you had no choice. Should have known he would have told you. And one always has a choice. I'm as guilty as the worst of my family. Unforgivable curses won't work unless you really mean them. I had to want to cause pain, and for that I shall never forgive myself. That spells the reason I have no family left. You and Sebastian will need to sort out another solution. If you cast Crucio, you will regret it forever. What do we do now? Ominous is not going to cast the Cruciatus Curse again. Ridiculous! As if dying in here is a better option than casting a damned spell. <sighs> it's up to us. I can teach you Crucio, or I can cast it on you. Wait, you didn't say you knew how to cast Crucio. Because I'm not sure I do. Ominous knows that, yet he's left us no choice. I don't yearn to follow in Noctua Gaunt's footsteps. I think I can cast this if I have to. Oh, this is tricky. Somebody's gonna get cursed. I want to learn the curse, and I think it's best if I cast it on you. Very well, if that's what you want. To perform the spell, raise your wand, point it at me, and firmly declare, Crucio. Hold on as long as you can. Here we go. Ready? I'm ready. to make it stop. <laughs> but I'll survive. <clears throat> Let's keep moving. Lumos. We made it. 
We found Salazar Slytherin's scriptorium. I can't believe we're here. Revelio. Lumos. Slytherin spellbook. Sebastian, ominous. There's a book just here. You found something. You two go ahead. Let me know what's in it. I'll wander around a bit. May I have a look? Wonder who wrote that? Probably Salazar. What do you think? Looks like a spell book of some kind. This is incredible. A Hogwarts founder's possession. What an honor. Still can't believe Ominous never told me about his aunt and what she found. What will you do with Slytherin's spell book? What I do with every book. Read it. Having professors as parents ingrained that habit early on. But I can do that later. For now, I say we explore this room. It's breathtaking. I've been getting an uneasy feeling about this place. We shouldn't linger here. Let's find a way out, please. I don't want to leave, but I owe you. Lumos! Both of you. Without both of you, we'd never have made it this far. We were lucky. We could have died. We must swear never to do this again. See a way out. Best news I've heard all day. Ominous. About your aunt. Please, Sebastian. I meant what I said before. We swear, right now, never to engage in anything to do with dark magic again. Understood. I'm truly sorry about your aunt, Ominous. I suppose after all this, I am grateful to know what happened to her. Thank you. Lumos. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Okay, that was such a weird quest into the Slytherin dungeon, but we completed it. We got what we came for. And now we have a Crucio curse, which I don't even know if I want to use it. I thought it was very interesting that you had to curse it on someone else. And I was worried Sebastian was going to get hurt. So thankfully he's all right, at least as far as we know. Onward we go. So the next thing we need to meet Poppy. She has something to show us. And it's in the Forbidden Forest. Of course, where else? Seems to be where most things are nowadays. Fast travel outside the castle. And I believe I'm going to go ahead and give High Wing a ride. Oh, 
High wing, go! Super cool to have a hippogriff right in your back pocket. best part about having high wing is you don't you don't have to worry about the speed running out because the the broom you only have so much when you're at high altitude Poppy's around somewhere around in here. Let's see. Descend is R. I didn't I've never used it. switch some spells so between the last videos I got to learn Defendo and also got Bombarda oh and Flipendo we got that as well so looking forward to using those in battle Is Highwing all right? I've been studying Salazar Slytherin's spellbook. Meet me in the Undercroft. I found something. Highwing's fine. I'm keeping an eye on her. She's safe, Poppy, I promise. Good. Whatever the poachers are up to, I want Highwing far from it. You said you had news about the poachers, and that some of it had to do with me. It did. I overheard them talking in the Hogshead and... Did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you on sight? Does this have anything to do with Rookwood and Harlow coming for you in the Three Broomsticks after the troll attack? It does, somewhat. But at the moment, I'm more concerned about what else you heard the poachers are up to. Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help, especially after what you did for Highwing. Does the name Horntail Hall mean anything to you? I'm afraid not. Why? What is it? The poacher's best kept secret, apparently. The name came up twice, but they never went into detail. I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making, at the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poacher spoke of this area, and I thought if we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you ever meet my gran, this trip never happened. Not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. I normally tell her everything. She might be my best friend after Highwing, but she knows how I feel about the poachers. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Whatever gave her that idea? This way. Off we go, deeper into the Forbidden Forest. Oh, 
tread carefully. An entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools? That we do not notice more and more of your kind around here, in league with the poachers? We aren't involved with them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they work with. Thankfully, they're friendly, at least at this point. He was Don't... certainly a charmer. That could have gone worse. Centaurs aren't exactly fans of wizard kind, and the poachers aren't helping matters. But why would he think that we had anything to do with poachers? I did notice the poachers talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. I've seen a dugbog behave that violently. It seems that a lot of beasts have been more aggressive than usual lately. I've noticed that too. It's almost like there's something in the water. This is... odd. What is it? Not entirely sure, but look around. If the poachers were here, perhaps we can find out why. Rebellion! Why wouldn't they take their cages with them when they left? Maybe because they didn't leave. Pelt. Poor beasts. Still smoking. They can't have been gone long. Rebellion. This is goblin metal. Seems out of place in a poacher camp. I should tell Poppy about it. Anything interesting? Poachers were here. All sorts of evidence. But I found something else. It's goblin made. I found goblin armor. Let's keep searching, but carefully. Merlin only knows what's going on here. I don't have a good feeling about this. How do goblin and poacher interests align? Look, down there! Definitely poachers. No creatures, though. So what are they doing out here? Let's take a closer look. They won't be happy to see us. Should we use disillusionment? Or perhaps a less discreet approach? Hard to say from up here. Let's get a better lay of the land. Anyone looking for trouble, found it in me. Hmm. Enter the tent. Guess we're going around. We'll see if we can sneak in. I think the last time I tried that, it didn't last very long. Oh, that's a brilliant idea. Come 
can't figure out why there's such a fuss over poaching. Always one, isn't there? Having a clue why there's such a fuss over poaching. There's enough beast flesh for everyone. I don't really think we're going to get in there without fighting them. Probably too close. Yep. I think it's too high to go this way. You can learn a lot from weather though, can't you? It's like everything's foretold right before you. What? What are you smiling at? Don't you go ah. giving me that look. I'm saying, if it's cloudy, like, you know, it might rain. What? Plus, we got one on the bridge. I don't think you're going to get across the bridge without them knowing, so. Might as well go ahead and take them out. that back who else we got someone messing about ha! Ha! Time to teach someone uh, One bar. Merlin, you'd think they were guarding the Minister for Magic himself. What is going on here? Only one way to find out. I like these. I, have to, I think we're going to have to build the bridge back. Revelio. One more. Gotta get my coins. Repair it. Well, there's stuff everywhere. What in Merlin's name? Are those dragons? Dragon fighting ring. This is Horntel Hall. The name makes sense now, and secrecy. 
No wonder the poachers were in Hogsmeade so much. Likely taking bets and spreading the word. Given how crowded it is here, how could they possibly enjoy this? The centaurs have every right to be disgusted with wizard kind. There must be more dragons here. The poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons. We should take advantage of most eyes being in the fight and look around. But be discreet. You especially can't afford to be spotted. Don't know what Victor was sinking straight in a bargain with him. Revenue. Have you heard from your family? Has even of your brothers come round to our way of thinking? Will they join us? Nah, they say we go too far. The violence is gonna end up in one. I say, if every last wizard is run through with a blade, then violence is gonna get me precisely what I want. Sickens me to work alongside any of them. Don't know how Ramrock's stomach's being near Rookwood, foul beast. Not much longer now. Soon our necks will be out from under wizarding boots. Wizard kind will pay for what they've done. Did you hear those goblins? Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Poppy, something's going on behind you. What's going on down there? They must have only just captured her. She's putting up quite a fight. Not a fair one, though. Not with her chained up like that. Let's even her on, shall we? Look, they've got a dragon egg. Hepodean from the looks of it. We can't leave it here, not with the plans they likely have for it. Revelio. <laughs> My character's moving. Oh, there you go. They're moving so slow. Alohomora. All right, I have the egg. Ready. The element of surprise will only buy us a few seconds. Let's make them count. Yes. A more hushed approach is likely wise. We got a whole bunch down here. Careful! Ram will warn his dragon in Yeah, I think you'll get it out. Oh, no. I'm not going to 
gotta keep getting it. to do that. In black. I'm guessing the egg we have belongs to that dragon. I don't think she knew they had her egg. She wouldn't have left without it. What now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I, I don't know. Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins and definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And the poachers saw us, which cannot be good. Should we expect trouble from the poachers, given the trouble we just caused? It'd be foolish not to expect it. They're not a forgiving lot. I'm sorry to say that you likely have a larger target on your back now because of what we just did. Since the dragon we freed flew off, does that mean we get to keep the egg? I'd much rather we have it than the poachers, at least for now. But I don't think we should keep it indefinitely. It'll be hard hiding something like this from Professor Weasley for long. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now, we're it. Be careful, won't you? I shall see you back at the castle.
that quest was way more than I expected. Didn't know we were going to get into freeing a dragon. That was pretty cool, though. It's time you learned the transformation spell. After you've completed the required tasks, which I'm certain will prove useful in finishing your field guide, attend my class to learn the new spell. Afterwards, we will discuss your progress thus far in the term. Okay, going to go back to Hogwarts. So we can get out of the forest. Don't want to be there any longer than I need to be. But I appreciate you watching the video. Thanks so much. That was a good one. Really liked getting to see the dragon up close, freeing it, getting it out of there. Hopefully we'll get to return the egg at some point. As always, I appreciate the support. Thank you so much. Don't forget to click the like button if it's earned it. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you get the notifications as the new videos are posted. And I hope to see you back on the next one. Until then, take care. So long.